What is up YouTube today with another PvP build for the Waking Flame DLC. I'm on my Magic and Necromancer here and I have another bomb build with Dark Convergence on the back bar and the Vicious Death on the front bar. In combination with the Malakad Ring and this juicy skill here, the Boneyard with the own synergy, Grave Robber, in combination with full harmony on the jewelry. Keep in mind this build is especially made for bombs, so don't expect to win a 1 on 1 against a good player or against small scalers. It's not a 1vx build, it's just a bomb build, which means you will probably die a lot. But trust me, guys, if you time the Grave Robber synergy with the Colossus, with Blast Bones, and Dark Convergence. It's basically an AOE one-shot. Let's talk about the PvP combination. It's pretty simple, like on every bomb build. Start with Blast Bones, into Colossus, then Boneyard, bar swap to your front bar, try to use the synergy exactly before Dark Convergence will explode, then use the synergy and spam Force Pulse. And as you can see, the enemies will burn. Let's check out the build, Balrog, S monster set, one medium, one light, both well fitted, one trainee, then dark convergence, on the back bar, the sword on board, vicious death, on the front bar, with an inferno stuff, lightning stuff would be even better, but I only have an inferno here. And then the Malakad Ring, a smithic item. Like I said before, full harmony on jewelry. I'm playing one heavy and one medium with five light for extra penetration. Full impen would be perfect. I'm with four impen, one divines and two well fitted. Jewelry full spell damage. Front bar a sharpened inferno with the shock damage glyph. Berserk is also fine. Back by Powered Dagger, an Olympian Shield, with the Saucer Draining Poisons, which gives minor sorcery. Pretty nice poisons, to be honest. And it also restores Magicka. Quick look on the skills Elemental Drain for Major Breach, Stalking Blast Bones, Force Pulls are spammable, Mortal Coil for an extra heal. Inner Light for more Max Magica and Dawnbreaker just slotted for extra spell damage. Back bar Avid Boneyard with the Grave Robber synergy. Race against time, our snare removable. Resistance Flash, a pretty damn strong burst heal. Summoner's Armor, our resistance buff. Spirit Guardian for extra healing and 10% damage mitigation and then the Colossus as ultimate. Race I am Khajiit, probably the worst race here but that's also my PvE char. High Elf Danmo is definitely better. Mundus the Lama for extra penetration, Witch Mother or Clockwork Citrus Filet as Bafut. 15 points in health and 40 9 points in Magicka. Potions. I mainly use the spare power potions with Major Sorcery, Major Prophecy, and Magicka. Sometimes even the detection potions against the Nightblades. Quick look on the CPs Master at Arms, Biting Aura, Resilience, and Dual Rebuff. Red CPs Pain's Refuge, Slippery, Sustained by Suffering and celebrity. And like always, now with some gameplay footage, but this time solo, without any mates, not needed for bomb build to be honest. So perfectly for lonely wolves.
sound, back to the sound. at the end of another pvp build video thanks for watching have a nice day and i'll see you hopefully in the next one ciao